Disaster management and mitigation is the body of policy and administrative decisions and operational activities that pertain to various stages of a disaster at all levels. It encompasses all the aspects of planning for and responding to disasters, including both pre- and post-disaster activities. Subjects for Masters in Disaster Mitigation and Management Geodata Processing Techniques and Models Study of various geodata processing techniques and models for Earth resources mapping and their practices for disaster-related studies. Study of modern field surveying and GPS surveying data acquisition tools, methods of total station and GPS surveys. Study of geospatial data modeling, geographic information systems, hardware and software components, data transformation, processing and analysis models. These are the reference books. Natural Hazards and Impact Assessment Study of various natural hazards, associated damages and lessons learned. Study of earthquakes, causes, and classification, estimation of size of earthquake, magnitude, and intensity, seismic waves. Study of landslides, causative factors, landslide monitoring, and prediction, landslide hazard zonation. Study of floods, causes of floods, flood damages, flood analysis and floodplain zoning, drought and its impact. These are the reference books. Managerial and Financial Aspects of Disaster Management Study of fundamental elements of disaster prevention, response, and recovery within an inclusive management policy framework. Study of most important factors that need attention for the implementation of disaster mitigation and management programs, legislation, key factors, principles, and ethics. These are the reference books. Hydrological Data Collection, Processing and Analysis Study of various methods for hydrological data collection, processing and analysis. Estimation of missing data in rainfall, runoff, and other parameters, record extension for rainfall and runoff data, interpolation, and cridging techniques, statistical rainfall runoff models. Study of graphical and analytical methods for normal, log normal, and gumbel distributions. These are the reference books. Landslide Hazard Assessment and Mitigation Study of Mapping and Hazard Assessment Techniques of Landslides and Protection Against Landslide Study of Natural Including Inherent Factors and External Factors as well as Anthropogenic Factors, Impacts of Natural Causative Factors Study of Grading of Slopes, Retaining Walls, Breast Walls, Drainage Measures, Rock Bolts and Rock Anchors, Biotechnical Measures, special tow walls and other stability measures. These are the reference books. Cyclone and Wind Engineering Study of Enhancing Wind Load Resistance of Structures Study of Basic Wind Engineering, Aerodynamics of Bluff Bodies, Vortex Shedding and Associated Unsteady Along and Across Wind Forces Study General Planning and Design Considerations Under Wind Storms and Cyclones Activities these are the reference books. Disaster Preparedness and Mitigation Study of various hazards, disasters and their mitigation. Study of do's and don't about disaster, damage survey for designing aid package and detailed survey for reconstruction, repair, and retrofitting. Study of post-disaster surveys, survey proformas, long-term measures disaster resistant construction, codal practices, Retrofitting Cost-Benefit Analysis These are the reference books Hazard Monitoring, Prediction, and Microzonation Study of methodologies to monitor, predict, and assessment of various kinds of natural hazards Study of remote sensing in landslide monitoring, GI's application, qualitative and quantitative hazard approaches, landslide hazard zonation Study of flood monitoring, distribution of rainfall, hydrological forecasting, flood mapping, basin studies, case studies of some major floods. Study of macrozonation and social economic factors and considerations, 
MICRO zones, engineering aspects, return periods. These are the reference books. Climate change and sustainable development. Study of urban boundary layer, urban canopy layer, layer of inversion, urban roughness and winds, aerosols, and their effect on cloud and precipitation. Study of ecosystem atmosphere interactions, underlying principles and measurement. These are the reference books. Disaster-induced risks. Study of both natural and anthropogenic disaster-induced risks and impacts on various components of the environment and man-made systems. Study of risks taxonomy according to hazardous agents such as physical, chemical, and biological agents, natural forces, social communicative hazards. Study of hazard identification and estimation, exposure slash vulnerability assessment, risk estimation. These are the reference books. Instrumentation and data mining techniques. Study of basic principles, methods, and applications of instrumentation, data processing and data mining. Study of recorded data, noise, transducer correction, low pass, and high pass filters. Study of knowledge discovery, data understanding, data cleaning, data transformation, discretization, feature selection. These are the reference books. Application of geospatial data for disaster mitigation. Study of remote sensing, GIs and GPS tools in various stages of disaster mitigation plans. Study of earthquakes, volcanoes, landslides, floods, cyclones, tsunamis, anthropogenic, industrial, chemical and environmental, fire etc. Study of role of remote sensing, GIS and GPS in each stage. These are the reference books. Flood estimation, forecasting and control. Study of floods, rainfall runoff method, flash floods, coastal floods, flood routing. Study of statistical procedure for flood frequency estimation, flooding due to dam break, flooding due to embankment failure. Study of graphical and statistical models, stochastic models, and adaptive filter models. Study of application of probabilistic and Markov models in risk estimation. These are the reference books. Elective subjects. Vulnerability and risk analysis. Man-made and biological disasters detection and mitigation. Socio-economic aspects of disaster management. Some of the roles and responsibilities of disaster recovery manager. Execution of all strategies and plans. Perform tasks regarding risk analysis in databases. Checking of all plans for recovery are carried out properly. Publishes an annual plan on data recovery strategies. Establishes testing methodologies. Trains all staff. Documents all problems and actions taken.